Pick a backpack over a purse chick Never at your service If all you wear is this <laughs> Don't it sound perfect? I know what I bring To the table To the table I know what I bring To the table y'all it's your girl Deezy your new best friend back with another video and today we're gonna do a get ready with me because today babe took a different shift so he's gonna be coming home at like 12 ish and we want to be looking cute or whatever I used to do this all the time when they used to work like he used to go to work at like 3 30 or 4 and then get off at 12 midnight so yeah so I just want to make sure that I'm looking cute when he comes home um and yeah I already have my badly drawn on eyebrows because if there's two things you can count on me for is to talk too much and bad eyebrows and so far I'm delivering on one of those right now how cute is this cup how cute is that it's like a shaker bottle and it says bae except for I just have vodka in it YOLO um, we're gonna go ahead and prime um, with the uh, sheer envy perfecting primer from hard candy this reminds me of the NYX angel veil primer so it's like a silicone based primer it's pretty good um, I don't know it's not really the best for combination skin but if you have a lot of pores and then just like textured skin then it's perfect now I know some of you girls out there can just get away with like the whole no makeup makeup look for Netflix and chill or your dick appointment whatever you call it but the way my skin is set up child is damn near gonna be a full beat not a full beat but like a full face this is what I've been doing lately I've been going in with this Milani 2-in-1 which is like my holy grail the Milani 2-in-1 I have it in medium beige and then I mix it with the born this way because listen this born this way I mean it wears really good throughout the day but I need I need high coverage I need more coverage because look no it's not cute sis and I'm running out of this so we're gonna like do this and put it on our beauty blender because we're a resourceful ass bitch and then I'm honest I'm just girl we just gonna put it on there it's not that serious Ooh, child mm -mm. So, okay, that was probably too much. Oh my God, that is like way too much. So I know you guys probably, I don't know if any of you guys saw my story time part one of I Married My Predator story time, which was like honestly a crazy like story for me to even start to get into on my channel because my channel's like brand new, but it just kind of like felt like the right time. And I don't know, it's like mad awkward to share stuff like that on YouTube. It just made me start thinking about how like I think I'm like desensitized to like people sharing like sensitive topics on YouTube because I've watched YouTube for so long that when you start to consider you talking about those things you're like oof it's like super uncomfortable and weird so now that I watch YouTubers through like a different lens some of the stuff that YouTubers talk about and like go into about their lives I'm like oh that you really have to put yourself out there. I didn't mean to put this much on because like th at this point this much is too much because when y'all start doing what you're gonna do what grown folks do that's too much. Um, I didn't mean to I don't even put that much on on my regular day but I'm gonna rock with it. Mm -mm -mm. 
it's gonna do. Yes, it is. And then I have my Born This Way multi-use sculpting concealer. Now this is worth the money. This is super full coverage. This will hide all of your sins. Now I have bags under my eyes. Anyway, I am so happy that the holidays are over. I know that that sounds so bad, but oh, it is too much. It's like one thing after the next, after the next. My holidays were trash. Y'all, I watched that Soldier Boy interview today on The Breakfast Club. He kills me. He really does. Honestly, I was just telling my friend, like, like, Takashi 69 who? Because Soulja Boy, Big Draco just stepped right up to fill his shoes. He is trolling the hell out of the internet. Every day my timeline and my Twitter feed is going nuts with some stuff that Soulja Boy said. He is too funny. Ooh, child, the drugs, I tell you. Watching his interview made me think about how, like, he honestly was the first person to like go viral off of like, you know, some online stuff. And you just think about how it's just like common nowadays. Also makes me feel mad old. And you, I love to bake with my uh, Beauty Bakery flour powder, but there's not very much in here. There's 0.49 ounces. Oh, and then my Sasha Buttercup has a whole 1.25 ounces. But the Sasha Buttercup is too, like, even the yellow is just too dark for me. I don't know who I was thinking I was going to buy Buttercup. Probably because um, I love the Ben Nye Banana Powder, and that works for me, even though I'm super fair. So, babe will be home soon, and I'm going to make something to eat, and we'll just chill or whatever. So, y'all, I'm so excited because this week, Mama's has a sleepover. So, this will be the first time without our child overnight well let's put it this way she's seven going on eight and we've only spent four nights away from her in, t in her whole life oh my god i need a break i need a break like yesterday so we're just planning on going and getting food like not even going out out but like getting food like take out um, he'll probably, cause I'm like, oh, I want seafood and then he wants ribs. So we'll probably go to both like wherever each other wants to go and then bring takeout back and then just drink and kick it. So my new drink are Moscow mules. I don't know if you guys know what those are, but it's just like vodka, lime juice, and then ginger beer. So good. I'm like real bougie when it comes to like drinking, like not even in the quality of liquor or like the ingredients, but I'm like real particular on my drinks. Like I don't like sweet drinks. I don't like drinks that are too sweet. I'm gonna bake with that and then the rest of it, I'm gonna just like set with the Sasha banana powder. Honestly, the only reason I do that is because when I go to like contour, I used to cream contour and then I started to powder contour, but either contour, it works weird when I don't set my face. I feel like it skips if I use powder contour. If I use cream contour, then I don't like do this. So I got this really cute bodysuit or like, I don't know what it is. It's like a little lingerie, like one piece that I got from Burlington that I'm super excited to try on. I got it in the 2X and it says 2X on the tag and everything. And then when I tried it on, when I came home, it was actually a 3X, which I don't know if it was a 2X, if it would have fit me better or what. Cause my upper half like isn't as big as my lower half. So stuff like that, like the cups always fit me like mad weird. And I'm just gonna do like a little bit of a contour. Like you have to have kind of something to snatch you like a little bit. So this is just that cheap contour palette that I literally got from the beauty supply store. I 
really don't know how to contour my nose. I say this every time I do like a get ready with me or whatever. So my goal is to try to do one video a week on my channel. Like I'm real protective of my family and not in the way like that some YouTubers are like protective, like not showing my family's face or like my my spouse's face or my child's face. Like I'm like super protective of my family's like time, if that makes sense. So because I work a full time job, like I try to be real cognizant of like not taking a lot of time away from my family, like on the weekends and like free time that we could be spending together. I just prefer to do things like this, like that are like my passion or something that I like to do for fun. I prefer to do it in times that don't take away from me being able to see my husband and my child. And that's just really like, I've always been like that. And I know it's really weird. It's because I like to do YouTube and I did vlog one day, just me and my little girl. And it was fun. Um, I don't know. I just don't know if I could see myself doing something like that. Like every time I do something fun because the reality is is like if I'm gonna do something fun with my like family like I'm the complete opposite so I have girlfriends who as soon as they have like plans or something fun like their first thought is like to pull off the camera I'm the opposite like I do stuff all the time that like nobody knows about that I never post about because like I want to be in the moment in that time if that makes sense and oh I better hurry I just realized so I'm gonna go put lashes on and I'll be back cause ain't no way, honey, ain't no way I can do that on camera. Mm -mm. I'm back, I tried to do lashes, they weren't having it. You guys know I'm not the best. That's why this lash looks all messed up cause I tried, it was not having it. So we're gonna use my Too Faced Born this way. And we're just gonna put that on. Cause I, honestly at this point, it's really not that serious, honestly. Listen, he's gonna get these lashes in whatever condition these lashes are in, okay? I'm gonna take this Wet n Wild highlighting Mega Glow Highlighting Powder. I don't know if you can see that. This is the one in like, I think it's like Petal Peach or something like that. Spray this with my Hard Candy 24 Hour, which kind of reminds me of um, the Milani Make It Last. This is entirely too much. I can't believe I used to do this like probably like three, four times out of the week for like years. hair and we're not about to do anything crazy because it is too late and today was supposed to be wash day but those can't happen on the same day listen Netflix and chill or a dick appointment cannot happen on wash day those are two separate days I'm at least gonna need 72 hours in advance to be able to have both of those done okay so we working with what we're working with I know, I know it, I know, it's bad, it's so bad, I know, we're gonna figure it out, give me a minute. Okay, I'm back y'all, as you can see, I threw my hair in some like, I don't know what you would call these, some of the like china buns, they're not even even, I'm telling you, I wish somebody would have told me when I was younger, nobody's checking for that, he's not checking for that, he's not checking to make sure that your lace isn't showing sis, he's not checking for any of that, no. Especially not on Netflix and chill nights because we're grown and that's not what we're looking for but I do want to make sure that I lay my baby hairs down a little bit like 
Y'all know I'm not the best. I don't belong to nobody, no, no I don't belong to you, baby, no Especially if you ain't claiming If you want me, you gotta make it known Make it, make it, make it known Make it, make it, make it known Don't worry about who I'm calling You want me, but you be stalling